Battle for PDP hasn't started yet. You are panicking and running. Kenya got here blasting wiki. What is happening again? So with all that has been happening since, you say battle has not started. Which other battle again do you want? How else do you want the battle to be? Okay, is Mickey running up and down? How is he running up and down? We also need to see. Let's see exactly how it goes. Uh, let's dive into the details to hear more from the Kenya Gochinere. The coalition of opposition lawmakers in Nigeria has criticized FCT Minister Nyeso Mike for his recent remarks about River State Governor Simna Laipubara. According to a leadership, the lawmaker dismissed Mike's comment as baseless, asserting that Governor Fubara would not defect from the People Democratic Party to join the All Progressive Congress APC. So Mike, who reportedly mocked Fubara ahead of the local elections, claimed he would teach the governor and his supporters the intricacies of politics. In response, the coalition's spokesperson, Honorable Kega Imo Gochinere, dismissed Mike's remarks as baseless, uh, baseless daydreams. Baseless daydreams. So Gochinere stated, Fubara cannot abandon the PDP for Mike. The battle for the soul of the party has not uh, even started and Mike is already panicking like an amateur politician, running from one court to another. He further criticized Mike, saying, Thank you, Fubara, we join APC and leave PDP for you, shows you are an overrated politician. Exactly. Re overrated politician. He went on to warn Mike of an impending political confrontation, adding, Watch and see how Fubara will deliver an upper court in the battle for the soul of the state, a portal for the soul of PDP. Rogochinere um, also claimed Mwike's influence over the reverse PDP is diminishing, declaring you can't do, you can't, and I repeat, you can't control it. So the coalition vowed to hold Mwike accountable for his actions, accusing him of repeatedly betraying the PDP for personal political gains and federal protection. Exactly. So the only reason he's starting PDP is for his selfish political gains and also uh, trying to align with APC so he can survive. Okay, those are the two reasons. So Gutnia says he's running from court to court. He's looking for a court to nullify the panel of inquiry that uh, Fubara put in place to investigate the burning of the local government uh, facilities in River State. So with all of that going on, Mwike is still trying to keep afloat. Uh, but Ugotinye is saying that uh, hey, battle has not started and you are here running up and down panicking. Don't panic. Just wait. This is the beginning of the game. Okay? There's no help anywhere for you. So those are, you know, the way uh, the way Ugotinye is viewing the action of Mwike at this moment. Now, I tell you, Mike is in one chance. Uh, but again, he's somebody that will never budge, will never give up. So the way he's resilient is you say way Fubara is resilient, Ugotinye is resilient, Ihungo is resilient. So that resilience um, displayed by both parties is uh, let's see how long it can endure. That is it. Let's see how long it can endure. Okay, and uh, somebody is saying here at the comment section, somebody has written, uh, hey, thank God there is at least much, uh, there is at least much wiki press statement for press statement because it would have been quite unfortunate if only one man is allowed to run gangster on the sensibilities of ignorant Nigerians. So, uh, Gotinger is now much for Wiki. Let them dig it one on one and let's see. So, it is fair and most times it's good to tell a useless drunkard man who thought that the world were created for him alone to think well because there is nothing in, the, in this life, no matter how strong and connected you are, one day you become useless. Wiki has never been a student of history. You can't destroy your world and still live on it in peace. It's not possible. <laughs> it's not possible. What Wiki is doing is destroying his own world. 
We go to why are you deceiving Fubara instead of helping him to reconcile with his boss? You could not withstand your emo governor. You jump to rivers. They will teach you a lesson in a hard way. Remember Saraki Mbadinuju of Anambra State? I pity you. Can you imagine? This person must be pro wicked. That is why he's trying to warn uh, Gochinere to stay out of a uh, river state matter. But the thing, eh? Hmm. It's okay. Uh, Fubara, uh, sorry, Gochinere is speaking as a federal lawmaker. So he, he can't close his eyes to what is happening in any state that is perceived or rather supposedly supposed to be uh, PDP states. And also, God will continue to protect you for speaking the truth. <laughs> exactly. I say thank you for speaking up always for Fubara. Organ we can wake up. It is daybreak. That is what you know. Take we can wake up. It is daybreak. You can't continue to oppress Fubara and still have peace. It's not going to work. Eh? It's not going to work. I know the Kenga has abandoned his legislative duties and is now the information commissioner for River State. Coalition of opposition lawmakers does not exist. It is the Kenga's uh front for political hustling okay oh anything you want to call gotinere he knows what he's doing gotinere you are not helping this crisis at all well that is what you think and all these people supporting uh Mwike are actually from the southwest not from the southeast south south or uh whatever okay i don't say i hope this will go to the last tenor because the one that carries another man's problems will definitely drop his own. Can you imagine? Now the who is go chinere, that's what you think. Alright. There are many problems in Imo State. You never talked the killings in okay, talked about the killings in Imo State, which is your immediate state. You never address it, but every time you are busy uh busy of river state matter okay what kind of person are you you never remove something in your eyes but you want to remove another person's own in his eyes <laughs> okay so the summary of this comment now is that uh Gautier has abandoned his roles and responsibilities in Nemo state and now focusing on river state the only thing is that he if he focuses more on river state definitely his role or bringing political uh, dividend, democratic dividend to his people in Imo State, we you know we fall to the ground. So now that uh, Gutierre has blasted uh, Mwike, what is Mwike going to say? So thank you for listening, and let's have your comment over Gutierre's statement against uh, Mwike.